Hello guys, welcome back. In this video, we are going to cover the important update from Infosys Spring Board. So Infosys Spring Board presenting Pragati Path to Future, a 12-week program designed for exclusively for women. That is, this program is purely meant for women candidates, those who are having 18 years and above. So for them, they are conducting free training program from January 2 to April 2025. They are given 12-week program, but here you can see here, the uh, training duration is 3.5 months. That means, so it is exclusively skilling development program for women will be anchored for duration of 3.5 months. Who are eligible and what is the process we will discuss here. So this program will cover the major areas like self-growth, professional advancement, career development and leadership skills. Now, through this program, we can learn the essential skills like digital uh, dexterity, gen AI, fluency, professional skill enhancement, leadership acumen and industry engagement. That means with this program, the persons or the people who are attending this training will be able to learn new tools as well as they can use new technologies in various uh, uh, domains. So they can also learn AI fluency. They can, this particular uh, program will be used for professional skill enhancement and they can learn leadership skills as well as the industry engagement. So with this program, they can able to know or they can able to learn how to engage the industry. The important points if you observe, this program is only for women aged 18 and above including students, young professionals, job seekers, career restarters, or simply lifelong learners. Only one condition is the person should be a woman and anyone can apply. Either the, the person may be student or professional or job seeker or career restarter. Those who restarting the career, they can also apply for this program. So the program will follow in hybrid model. That is one week at the Infosys campus or the Infosys ne nearest in Infosys campus and rest is on virtual mode, that is online mode. So the participants from earlier cohorts, those who already registered and those who got certificate from previous cohort. For example, if we take cohort three, which is uh, organized during September 2024. So those who already applied and those who got certificate from previous cohorts, either that may be three, two, one. If any one of the students got the certificate from previous co cohorts, they are not allowed to register here. So if any gentleman opt for this cohort, the registration will be automatically cancelled. So the next process we are going to see is once your CV is shortlisted, once your name is shortlisted, they are going to share two courses as well as one certification with you. That means you need to complete the two courses which are available in Infosys Springboard. Once you complete the two courses as well as one certification also, they are going to share with you. So once you selected, we will share the complete program schedule for virtual lessons. You can interact directly through virtual mode and there is also one week of program with Infosys campus. So the schedule for in-person sessions will be shared with only those participants who have kept up with the learning and certification clearance schedule. That means whatever the two courses we have, whatever the two courses they are sharing, if you complete the two courses, then only you will be allowed to do in-person internship or in-person training in Infosys campus. They are going to check your progress every 15 days once. So the learners who are not consistent or fail to keep with the requirements, then you are excluded from that particular cohort. So like this, so if you are interested, what we need to do is we need to open the Infosys Springboard page, then click on login. If you have login credentials, you can use that login credentials to login. Otherwise, simply register. As I already registered here, so you can see when you click on login, it will show you this particular page. As you can see, hello, your name and Pragati Path to Future Cohort 4 12-week program exclusively for women. So this total duration of this course is going to be 3.5 months here. The registrations are open from December 23 to January 2nd. So January 2nd is the last day to apply for this particular program. So once you see, click on start survey. So when we click on start survey, it will ask you the privacy agreement here. Simply accept and start. So when we click on start, we need to fill this form here. So this survey is to accept nominations for Infosys Springboard Pragati Path to Future Cohort 4. So whatever the star marks are mandatory, we need to fill the your name here, full name, then registered Infosys Springboard mail ID, whatever the mail ID you are using to log in, the same mail ID we need to keep here, gender, definitely it is a female here, then age above 18 or not, if you say yes, if you are above 18, otherwise no. So definitely, if you are below 18, you are not going to be shortlisted. Would you like to nominate yourself for Infosys Springboard Pragati Path to uh, Future Program Code 4, yes or no, click on yes, definitely. You need to give your introduction which describing about yourself within 300 words just type here then 
what is your current employment status whether you are a student or graduate or graduate and employed post graduate looking for job post graduate and employed seeking job change like this based on your criteria based on your eligibility you can select any one of these options select your educational qualifications here undergraduate graduate post graduate and phd like this if you are pursuing ug simply click on ug and if you completed undergraduate you say graduate post graduate and phd based on your qualification you can select that if you are a student kindly provide full name and city of your college or university so this information we have to fill about your college or about university so if you are a student what type of institute you are studying whether you are studying in government or private college or private university so if you are a student please share the approval from from a college authority to participate in infosys spring board so if you are interested you need to take the letter from college so that there is, you can say simply noc no objection certificate you have to take from your college and say yes or no approval sent or not you need to fill and how do you know about this program you can use any one of these options here i received an email i saw from social media post you can select this one or friends someone else my institution like this you can have so in which city you'd like to attend the infosys spring board so nearest to city you can select here if you are near to bangalore click on bangalore so that one week of program you are going to do in the infosys bangalore campus like this so based on your area or based nearest office you can select it is not mandatory to select the nearest office but usually the nearest office will be allocated for us to go for one week of training program so choose your preferred learning path which path you are going to have it foundation or ai citizen data science based on your interest field you can select any one of these three then click on submit that's all so once you submit you will get the confirmation mail and they'll review your application or the, uh, after uh, reviewing you may be shortlisted once you shortlisted they will send the mail a shortlisted uh, mail for you so that you can start internship from january so that's all for now if you have any queries simply comment on me so that i'll try to reply thank you all the best